Let's solve this system by using the elimination method. Let's begin by naming these equations 1 and 2. And with the elimination method, our goal is to get rid of a variable by adding these two equations together. We can see that that's not going to happen at this point because our coefficients are not opposites. But let's work on these coefficients of x. We can turn this 3 and 2 into a 6 pretty quickly. So let's multiply that top equation through by a constant of 2 and then multiply this second equation through by a constant value of negative 3 to create opposites for the coefficient of x. Equation 1 as we multiply through by 2 becomes 6x plus 8y is equal to 18. Equation 2 then becomes a negative 6x minus 15y is equal to a negative 39. And now when we add those two equations together, the variable x gets eliminated. 8 plus a negative 15 for the y coefficients is a negative 7y. And 18 plus a negative 39 is a negative 21. As a last step, let's divide both sides by negative 7 to get y equal 3. We're halfway there. Let's go back and solve for the value of x. We've got y equal 3. Let's substitute this value for y equal 3 into equation 1. Equation 1 is 3x plus 4y is equal to 9. Substituting y equal 3 into this equation, we have 3x plus 4 times 3 is equal to 9. That is 3x plus 12 is equal to 9. Subtracting 12 from both sides, we have 3x is equal to negative 3. Dividing by 3x is equal to negative 1. And so the solution set for this system is the point x equal negative 1, y is equal to 3.